Hello, my name is Dennis Witt, guitar instructor for Classic Folk Guitar Lessons. And today I want to really do a lesson, or maybe it's really more of a story, um, about how to tune your guitar using your phone. Um, of course, today we would never probably do that because um, we've got uh, um, electronic guitar tuners and uh, smart apps and stuff like that that uh, are readily available and inexpensive. But back when I was growing up in the 60s and the 70s, uh, well, at least in the 60s, we didn't have too much of that stuff. Well, we didn't really have any of it. So um, it was common to use a pitch pipe or a tuning fork. Um, and if you didn't have one of those, maybe you had a piano, but most of us didn't. And so uh, what I wound up doing uh, fairly often was to tune my guitar using the tone, the dial tone on a landline phone. And I'm gonna uh, tell you a little bit about that. Uh, I'm just gonna read uh, what I've got because I already kind of got it planned out. So uh, let me go ahead and do that. When I was learning to play the guitar back in the 1960s, my friends would get a blank look on their face when I wanted to tune my guitar and they saw me pick up the phone, landline of course, and just listen to the dial tone. That dial tone was actually two notes, an F and an A note. As I listened, I would focus on the higher note of the two, which was an A note, and then tune my A string, which is a fifth string open on the guitar, to the A note on the phone. The A note on the guitar and the A note on the phone were in two different octaves, but still A notes. You try it sometime uh, if you have a landline phone. So let me go back to uh, my uh, webcam. Okay, I got my guitar handy here. And I think it's in tune, but if it weren't, I would use, I could use the phone and uh, maybe you can hear this. So that's two notes, an F and an A. The actual notes, I think, are probably uh, these two notes. Or they might be these two. But anyway, for all intents and purposes, uh, um, I mentioned that I would focus on the higher note of the two, which in either case is going to be an A note. So. Um, just happens that the fifth string open on the guitar is an A string. So if you hear that, uh, if you can pick out between those two notes, the A note, you can tune the fifth string to that. So on the phone, it might sound, an A might sound like this. On the guitar, you would have this. So anyway, I guess you have to have a little bit of an ear for music to be able to do that but it was uh, unique and <laughs> I got a few uh, funny looks from people when I would do that. So that's just a little tidbit that I thought I'd tell you about the 60s. Um, while I'm thinking about the 60s, I want to remind you that uh, what I teach on my website is uh, uh, a lot of classic folk songs from the 60s and 70s and uh, there's some beginning guitar lessons as well. Um, so you might want to check that out. It's at, uh, uh, classicfolkguitarlessons.net and, uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you.